All right, Big in Vegas and Beyond back with another haul video. <laughs> and I'm gonna do the haul video from, well, before I show you that, let me show you the other stuff that I found. I found four B Core vats that need cleaned up. This is the first one. This is the second one. Third one. And here is the last one. This one is a lot heavier than the other ones for some reason. But yeah, those are the bats. I've also had a lot of stuff coming in from because my family has been doing a lot of like work on uh, foreclosures and stuff. So eventually I'll get around to showing all the stuff that's been coming in from that, but I won't be showing that today. Anyway, and I wasn't planning on doing a haul for this either, but I decided to. These are Brooks. Um, that particular Goodwill does not know this brand, so they had these priced at $3.99, which is good for me, bad for them. Um, everything else was crazy priced. These are a little bit dirty, but other than that, they're in really good condition for how old they are. These are Alpha Bounce. Got some Vapor Max. Um, some more Vapor Max. Some more Brooks. I found a ton of stuff. I spent like almost four hundred dollars. Um, these are Asics. I got them because, just because, because <laughs> I know I can make a profit on them. So. I don't normally buy um, Under Armour shoes very often, but I found several that were profitable, so I bought a lot. I even found a pair on vacation. Actually, I think the ones I found on vacation were only like the second pair that I've ever bought to resell. Because most Under Armour shoes are not worth picking up. But these were, if I can, it'd be nice if I could actually get the bag untied because a lot of times I end up reusing the bags for my trash. That way it saves me money so I don't have to keep buying trash bags. These are Converse. CrossFit shoes. I have another pair of CrossFit shoes that I previously found. These are another pair of Under Armour shoes that I found that were profitable. I didn't look these up, but I just guessed that I could make some money on them just because of how they look. I've never seen these before, but they're in brand new condition. They're called Sketch Air. And I didn't pay very much for them, so we got some uh, skates. Look 
like quality skate, skates, so I picked them up. Got a mile long receipt. Like I said, I paid almost 400 bucks. What was it? Total was, yeah, over $300. <laughs> I know I'm probably sweating like crazy. Uh, I know I'm sweating like crazy. But I don't know if you'll be able to see it in the video. I hope not. My shirt is soaked in sweat. But that's what happens when you live in the desert. Here's... I forgot the... Yeah. I don't think I've ever found this particular um, type of Nike before, but it surprised me what they're going for even in used or pre-owned condition. Those are some expensive Nikes. They don't look like it, but they are. <laughs> and then we have another pair of Steph Curry's and that one gray pair of uh, under Armour, that's another style of Steph Curly, Curry's, those are, uh, I think those are called the Storm, and here's another pair of Under Armour, like I said, I found a lot of shoes that I don't normally find lately, and these are some, this brand I always pick up, and for some, whatever reason, I always find this brand of shoe and like, pretty much brand new condition and they're expensive too so yeah, that always surprises me and of course I found a pair of foam posits and then another pair of Nikes um, never seen this style of Nikes before they're really lightweight. I looked them up and I forgot what they go for, but I'm guessing I'll make some decent money on them. But actually, I know I will because anything I looked up, if it didn't go for good money, I didn't get it. So, yeah. <laughs> That's going to do it for this one. I just wanted to make some haul videos. I have a... This place is... I gotta get my other building completed because I'm running out of room in this one <laughs> because I've been picking up so much stuff and both with myself, my wife, and I just noticed one of my cabinets that holds my smalls seems to be falling over for some reason. I'm gonna have to, I can't get over there right now so I can't fix that, but anyway, um, yeah, I got to get the other building completed. Because this one is as full as I'm going to be able to get it. And I have a lot more stuff coming. So, yeah. I have a ton of work to do. I'm going to be making videos again. I went like two years without even filming anything. Because I got so far ahead with videos. But I'm going to start making videos again. 